hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video i am going to show you how to create a complement intersection union using node red okay so basically i am using two array here so i will be adding some inputs in that so that is left array and right array okay so i will be uh, doing a functionality of complement intersection and union so basically complement is a sets the output to what is left input but not the right output okay you can see the result over here and intersection is the sets the output to what is the left input that also in the right and last is the union sets the output to what is the left inputs but what's in the right okay so let's get started with the practical part so if you are new to the channel or if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel kindly subscribe so without wasting time let's get started so this is the node red screen now so i'll be taking an inject node to trigger second will be a change node where i will be passing the arrays left array and the right array okay after that i need to add the right array also so here comes my data that is right array data and left array data so i added some fruit names and vegetable name here so basically here onion and tomato are the two values which are similar in this okay click on done after that i will be taking difference node so here they already set with the left and right input so three processes i'll be following up complement intersection and union so as you know so basically before that i will be entering the name here so find difference click on done and to view the responses i will be taking debugger node okay click on deploy so here the data will be basically a json format so i will be selecting complement so here the data will be basically a left side array a data which is from the right side array and it will be a unique one which are not matching with the left array that's a complement and the second will be a intersection so when you click on deploy here it will be showing the data which are matching in the both the arrays that is onion and tomato at the end last function is union so as you know union is nothing but a data which are all present in both arrays which are so it will be a unique array so duplication will not be there so you can see in the responses i hope you got some understanding of this process how it works Thanks a lot guys for watching this video. Hope you like this content. Kindly do subscribe, like and comment down below if you want more videos like this. Thanks thanks a lot guys.